you're familiar with PayPal standard in WooCommerce, but did you know there's a second way to use PayPal now? If you weren't aware, then you're in the right place. Let's talk about the PayPal powered by Braintree Gateway. To get started, head to WooCommerce, Settings, Checkout, then the PayPal powered by Braintree submenu. If you don't see this, check that you have the PayPal powered by Braintree Gateway. Go to Plugins, Installed Plugins. You may have added it if you used the quick setup wizard and didn't realize it. If you don't have it, select Add New and search for it. Be certain you search for its full name, PayPal powered by Braintree. You'll find the one we've released for free when you see it's by WooThemes. Now that everyone has it installed and activated, let's head back to our settings. Like any other, this gateway allows you to accept credit and debit cards, as well as lets your customers pay with their PayPal account if they prefer. The first option you'll see is a big connect with Braintree button. Give it a click and you'll be taken to the Braintree site where you can log in to your existing account or set up a new one. We won't cover applying for a new one as they do a great job walking you through the process. You can also connect using the sandbox mode, which is meant for testing and not accepting live orders from customers. Once you're connected how you'd like, you can enable the gateway. Then the following settings help you clarify when someone is paying with a card or using their PayPal account. First, for using a PayPal account, title it, for example, use your PayPal account, and write a short description if you'd like. Next, for paying with cards, title it, for example, use your credit or debit card, and write a short description if needed. Both the title and the description will be displayed during the checkout process. With most WooCommerce themes, the title is always visible, and the description will be shown if the payment gateway is selected. The following option lets you set to either capture the charge immediately, or if left unchecked, authorize the charge. If enabled, the customer will be charged immediately. If disabled, an authorization will be issued, but the store manager will have to capture the funds later when reviewing the order. Finally, you can choose to enable or disable debugging messages. If debugging is enabled, all error messages will be added to the WooCommerce system status log. If there is ever a problem with this gateway, enabling this log will help you find out the problem faster. Select Save Changes and you're done. Now your checkout is powered by Braintree. Here's to growing a money tree with WooCommerce. Thanks for watching.